Hello everybody. Within my presentation, I would like to give you a short overview about neonicotinoids and emergency authorizations and the situation in Europe and Great Britain. In my first slide, I would like to start with a very short history of the situation. And for the active substances, imidacloprid, tiamethoxan and clotianidine, the outdoor uses were banned in May 2018. The renewal of approval for tiaclubrid was rejected in January 2020. But also the products are not on the market anymore. There is still a need to, pro to use these products and so many emergency authorizations were granted in the EU. And you see here the picture for the years 2020, 2021. And in these years, 11 member states granted 17 um, emergency authorizations for the two active substances, tiamethoxan and imidacloprid. And this are, is only the number for sugar beet. And the conclusion of the EFSA assessment was that all 17 emergency authorizations are justified and there were no alternative product or no alternative method and it was a high risk that a pest could become resistant to the virus. And you see the same picture in the year 2022 and the first quarter of 2023. Also for this time frame, already 17 emergency authorizations are granted for these two active substances and for sugar beet only. So there is a strong need to use neonicotinoids in the EU. And we have the same picture here in Great Britain. Also here many emergency authorizations were granted. Here the picture for tiamethoxan on sugar beet in the year 2021 as well as 2022. And the estimation for 2022 is that almost 70% of the sugar beet crops could be affected by the virus. So also here is a strong need of neonicotinoids in the Great Britain. I hope you enjoyed this short overview and I would like to thank you for your kind attention.